Nate Robinson actually reached out to me. And, uh, no way. I, I, oh, I, I don't want to say I talk shit on him, but I, you know, I said Jake Paul has been in there for two very good, not very good boxers, so we don't actually know a lot about him. So I thought it was, man, it gave me a lot of respect for Nate Robinson for, you know, I didn't really ever specifically say anything negative about him. I just said, you know, Jake was in there against guys, two guys who never boxed before. Yeah. yeah. So Nate reached when out. When did he reach out? After uh, the fight? Yes. Yeah, Sunday, Sunday morning or something. What did he Sunday. say? My phone's my phone's over this. My phone's charging okay. over there. Uh, uh-huh. He just said something like, "Yeah, I understand how bad it sucks, and you know the public will forget about it." Which the uh, I didn't. I don't know if I agree with him on that one because you know I've been getting the Mazadal need gift for effing two years, um, so the public doesn't really forget. Uh, and that hey, as long as you have good people around you, your, your life's gonna go on. And I to that part I agree with. You know I. I keep telling you, I love what I do for a living and I have my, I love my wife and I have some awesome kids and we had a great day yesterday. And so, yeah, life does go on.